Welcome to today's edition of Layoff and Employment News by Employment Boost. If you are an individual affected by a layoff, or if you are a company facing a reduction in force, click the link above now or in the description box below for more information about our firm's outplacement support services and how we can help you as an individual land on your feet faster and get into a new job as quickly as possible, or as an organization, how we can smooth the layoff process and assist with your reduction in force. Welcome to today's edition of Layoff and Employment News by Employment Boost. Today's date is Monday, August 5th, 2024. Now on to today's headlines. San Francisco-based biotech firm Ver Biotechnology announced plans late last week to cut 141 employees, around 25% of the firm's staff. Included among the layoffs are a number of senior executives with five VPs, four SVPs, and dozens of directors being cut. Additionally, scientists, engineers, and other direct research roles were impacted. The company has stated that the layoffs will mostly be complete by the end of October and are part of a restructuring to focus more money on hepatitis research while cutting COVID and flu research programs. Match Group, the owner of a number of dating apps, including Hinge and Tinder, announced a 6% reduction for us last week. The layoffs were specifically related to Match discontinuing live stream services for two of its apps, Plenty of Fish and BLK. Match is also shutting down the Hakuna app entirely, which it acquired in 2021 as part of its purchase of HyperConnect. Match has shifted from live streaming due to the popularity of in-person dating after the COVID-19 pandemic, and is instead shifting its technology focus towards generative AI. Finally, the video game industry continues to slide with the news breaking late Friday that Game Informer, one of the last remaining gaming magazines, is shutting down after 33 years. Game Informer, which is owned by GameStop, lost its entire staff due to layoffs. The publication did not give a reason for the shutdown and GameStop did not reply to requests for comment. The Game Informer employees have already been let go as they were abruptly told the news while working on their next magazine issue. There's been no reporting of any support given by GameStop to the impacted staff members. Lastly, we are one of the leading global outplacement and career consultancies on the planet. If you are interested in resume assistance, career planning, or coaching assistance for yourself or your staff, please don't hesitate to reach out to me today. 